सो नाउ वी आर टेकिंग एक्सरसाइज फोर पॉइंट वन क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री रोमन नंबर फाइव रोमन नंबर फाइव लेट मी राइट ऑन द क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन इज एक्स प्लस फोर वाई इज इक्वल टू टू एंड थ्री एक्स प्लस ट्वेल्व वाई थ्री एक्स प्लस ट्वेल्व वाई इज इक्वल टू सिक्स सोल्यूशन x plus 4y is equal to 3x plus 12y is equal to 6. Take the first equation. x plus 4y is equal to 2, and x will be equal to 4y. Transfer that side. It will be 2 minus 4y. Equation number one. Okay. Draw the table now. This is x and this is y. Okay, x is equal to two minus four y. X is equal to two minus four y. Now, instead of y, you try putting zero. So when y is equal to zero, x will be equal to two minus four into zero, which is two minus four zero to zero. So it is two. When y is equal to one. X will be equal to two minus four into one, so two minus four into four minus two. When y is equal to two, let's not take y is equal to two. Okay, let's take y is equal to two. So x is equal to two minus four into two. It will be two minus four to the eight. It will be minus six. So draw all these things in the table. Write down all these things in the table. So a y zero x is two. Y zero x is two. Y one x is minus two. Y one x is minus two. Y two x is minus six. Y two x is minus six. That's all. Now let us draw the graph. X is two. For x it is two, and for y it is zero. So this is the point. Two zero. X is minus two. X is minus two, and okay. X is minus two here. And y is one. Y is one here. X is minus two, and y is one. And x is minus six. X is minus six, and y is two. X is minus six, and y is two. Minus six and two, and join this line. X plus four y is equal to two, and this is a b. Now, let me change the color of my pen, and let me write down next equation. That is three x plus twelve y is equal to six, and I can write down three x is equal to six minus twelve y divided by three. Okay. 6 minus 12y x is equal to 6 minus 12y and 3 will come and divide this side. How 12y came this side? So 12y transfer this side plus 12y will become minus 12y. Okay, and nothing else there. Okay, here it is divided by 2. So now let me draw the table. Tabulation for equation number 2. Okay, you have to write down tabulation for equation number 2. 1, 2, 3. This is x. This is y. So when y is equal to zero, so let us let me try. X equal to six minus x is equal to six minus twelve y divided by three. Y is equal to zero. Then x will be equal to six minus twelve zero to zero divided by three. Six minus three, three to the six. When y is equal to one, it will be x is equal to six minus Twelve into one divided by three. Six minus twelve. It is minus six divided by three. Three to the six. That is minus two. Y is equal to. Let's try with. I've done one zero and let us try. Minus one. It will be. Three six eighteen. So minus one. So x is equal to six minus twelve into minus one, divided by three. So six minus into minus plus twelve divided by three. Six plus twelve eighteen divided by three. Three six eighteen, which is six. So let me write down all these things here. 
so x is when x is equal to y is 0 x is 2 y is 0 x is 2 and y is 1 x is minus 2 y is 1 x is minus 2 and y is minus 1 and x is 6 y is minus 1 x is 6 let me draw all these things in the graph x is 2 x is 2 y is 0 so this is 2 0 here also 2 0 x is minus 2 x is minus 2 and y is 1 so y is x is minus 2 and y is 1 so same point here and x is 6 and x is 6 and y is minus 1 so here 6 minus 1 I think this must might have so I can draw the line okay the line will be coincident right I can just it's same point right if I join all these things sorry sorry <laughs> this will be a straight line right so this will be CD CD and the next equation the CD is written as 3x is plus 12y is equal to 6 so since so what shall I write? Let me write down here. You write down in the blank paper. Okay. Since A, B and C, D are coincident, are coincident. Okay. They are coincident. So every point on this coincidence, okay, on this line, okay, every point on this line is the solution. So they are infinite solution for the infinite solution for the given equation for the given linear equation given pair of of linear equation okay this one you just uh, you can just refer to your teacher's note or you can refer to the book and example and all those things and write down all these things also okay if it is not much clear to you but the my main intention of doing all this question is how to make all this table and draw the graph i hope you understood that much if you don't understand please write down in the comment below that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video